Go for a five minute blitz. Okay, develop as usual. Knight defending the pawn, managing this square. Let's bring the bishop out as well. Open up the dark square bishop and let's just bring it support in the night for now and castle. One last thing, let's just push this pawn here. Captures and um, is there a move order thing here? Let's just capture and capture and capture. Okay, so it's got centralized pawns. We want to sort of manage around the edges. Let's see if we can manage that. So when I say the edges this type of area here managing around rather than focusing on the center here simple capture and let's just get the queen out a little bit maybe to here it's going to move the bishop maybe get the rook coming across so that's a few tempi moves so let's just focus maybe get a doubling on here Depends on what they do next. Um, it's protecting the pawn, but he's actually angling to come here. So if you can see that beautiful spot, he might bring his queen here, looking for the battery going there. So because we know this, we can make some inroads. Maybe we bring our bishop here. Let's just bring the bishop here for now. Prevention is better than cure most of the time. Like we said, the rook is probably coming here to x-ray through to the queen, so I'll probably come this side with the queen. Okay, so you may be challenging this pawn, so let's, um, shall we? If we do, then they come and challenge the knight, so I'm going to move the queen first there is going to be the x-ray through at some point <clears throat> excuse me yep so it's coming for the pawn the queen's protecting it at the moment so shall we just do a small rook move while we're thinking just getting uh, position trying to put a bit of pressure onto his time it's chomping at the bit to get this pawn moved let's not forget we have the bishop taking so he's definitely coming for that so let's put the rook opposite the queen so we're moving at an okay pace at the minute I feel like we're doing safe moves not really hitting the king anywhere so he's moved this queen off of the line doesn't want the rook facing it's targeting targeting twice it's on a white square maybe we'll bring the queen in this time to maybe try and challenge this way let's go with that don't want to overthink smallest of potato moves i'm doing um it doesn't have a white square so it's not got much there a white bishop, sorry, did I say a white square? So 
So he's still in essence kind of looking for this spot with the diagonal through with the bishop but also he's wanting to maybe bring the knight into the game somehow you know to sort of face off here so he's trying to champion this doesn't want the exchange so we need to move swiftly now queen I'm trying to get my queen towards him uh, let's do this for now he can always drop his pawn and stuff like that he's moved it right far over to the corner so he's challenging this he doesn't have a white square bishop but his knight's going to get into the action um, what is my knight doing queen 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 let's just get the queen a little bit closer Okay, so let's take this um, queen off the board take this knight off the board as well so we'll get the knight for free that all seemed to happen quite quickly didn't it I think placement of the pieces helped us a little bit there Just working them together but it's not over yet he does have now a half open file in front of the king. Oh, and they've resigned. Okay, that was a nice, interesting, slow, steady development through the game. Um, I don't really think I need to do evaluation on this one because we did we broke it down during the game. So fairly comfortable with that. I think it's more about appropriate positioning definitely looking at what the opponent was actually attempting to do you know like the queen and bishop battery type thing blocking that off with a simple maneuver so prevention better than cure i think that's what this um, video is all about and we continued the prevention better is better than cure all the way through to the end because somehow he wanted his knight and his queen to try and suffocate our king area but we put a plat we we didn't even have to put a plaster over it we basically um gave it some antibiotics <clears throat> to sort out the internal problems before they even flared up so yeah prevention better than cure nice idea